Hey guys, in this video, we're going to talk about how to earn $100,000 plus with just the bare minimum of web development skills. Okay, we're talking about HTML, CSS, and JavaScript and just the basics. We're not talking about being an expert. So if you guys are interested in this, stay tuned. We're going to talk about it and we're going to start with this. All right, guys. So let's get started with what exactly is Shopify. So Shopify is an online e-commerce platform where you can create any type of online store to sell any type of product meaning you could sell electronics you could sell a hat you could sell t-shirts you could sell phone cases you could sell anything on shopify i'm pretty sure that you guys have heard of shopify from you know different advertisements or videos that you see online on youtube where they talk about how you can sell your products online how you're able to do drop shipping how you're able to make money uh with basically just selling products online okay and we have seen how shopify has been going to the top every single year because of how good of a platform it is right a lot of people love it it provides you everything security hosting pretty much everything that you need to run a successful online store so this is what shopify is it's pretty much a online e-commerce cms content management system where you could just go in put blogs you could go in put in your products you could basically run your whole website through shopify now let's talk about the role of a developer and why should you care about shopify well shopify again provides everything for somebody to be able to create an online store but as you guys may know every business is different every business has a different logic that it needs uh needs different type of customizations and that's where we come in as developers we basically provide that service to the online store owners okay we provide the technical side shopify is going to provide the infrastructure but we are the ones that is actually creating the customizations and also to whatever you know custom apps or themes that this online store needs for this store owner okay so let's say for example you are a small you know small time store owner and you need to change your header or you need to change your menu or you need to change you know the picture on the website that you might have well a lot of people don't know how to do this themselves so this is where we come in as developers and we get to do that for them okay at the same time when you are in the world of e-commerce there's going to be a lot of a and b testing okay what do i mean by this let's look at a website like this fashionnoble.com right let's say they wanted to test to see does it work to have a big banner on the top or should they go in and start promoting uh sale on the top or should they just start showing products right these are things that they constantly keep on testing when you have an e-commerce store okay new features new ways of improving the website make the website a little bit faster um maybe changing the way to how the layout is does it work having you know a page where it shows a, a model right now over here does it work if we had it on this side do we have a button that says add to bag or do we have an icon so there's so many things that happens in an e-commerce store that you want to go in and do a and b testing but most of the time the store owners don't know how to do this so this is where we come in as developers we know the technical side of things and we can build this for them now let's talk about the technical side what exactly is it that you need to know to become a shopify developer and let's break it down like this you need html css and also javascript to be able to build shopify themes and work in the shopify platform again you're also going to need another language which is pretty much a templating language called liquid and once you know these things you're good to go okay now this is one of the jobs that we have seen here that's being posted on websites like indeed.com there's plenty of jobs every single month i keep track of this there's probably you know anywhere between 500 to a thousand new jobs every single month being added for shopify developer it could be for shopify front end shopify back end to basically create uh shopify applications but every single month i see new jobs from 500 to a thousand jobs okay new jobs every single month created all right so again the demand is there and if we look over here on google's ads keyword planner and you could search for shopify developer you will see exactly what's the demand that's out there every single month you'll see that there's about 4400 people searching for 
Shopify developer. Same thing for Shopify expert, 25, uh, 2,900, right? This is people that have stores, right? And now are looking for somebody to help them with their online store. It could be either to hire them full time or to have them work as a freelancer. Okay. So again, there's a lot of keywords in here that people keep on searching Shopify plus expert, Shopify website designer, developer development, Shopify expert cost. This is what people are searching for and it's because they need our services. Same thing if we look over here for build online store, how many times people have been searching for this every single month? E-commerce website builder, build online store, best e-commerce website builder, create an online store, uh, best website builder for online store. All of this is gonna gear people towards Shopify. Shopify is the number one platform for e-commerce right now. So again, not only is there's a huge demand for people looking to create new stores, but also too, with that demand of creating new stores, there's a demand for us as developers to provide this service to this online store owners. Now, again, I just show you guys a job here, Shopify front end developer, JavaScript, HTML, right? 80 to 120 K. What are the qualifications? Look at where they start at high school high school equivalent they're not asking you well you got to know 20,000 different type of algorithms how to sort the tree binary tree like this is not a tech company this is an agency that's doing e-commerce online stores for clients and they're willing to pay you 80 to 120 thousand dollars now you might be asking why are company willing to pay so much money for Shopify developers okay this is basically the bare minimum of skills that you need to call yourself a developer or even a front end developer. Why are they willing to pay so much? Well, think about it like this. Let's say you are the small time, you know, business owner or this is your first time doing an online store, right? Uh, most of the time you're going to start from here. You're going to start by hiring uh, experts, people to help you out uh, with your online store. And you can see people are getting paid a hundred dollars an hour, a hundred K plus earned. Okay, $65 an hour, $125 an hour, $120 an hour, $75 an hour, $50 an hour, $200 an hour, $85 an hour. Okay, people are willing to pay this money because in reality, they don't know how to do certain things and they still need to get it done regardless. And because there's not that much uh, people that's actually knowing this skill, um, you know, developers are able to charge whatever they really want when it comes to freelancing. Okay. Now let's show you guys, this guy, uh, Modesty E shout out to him. I don't know him. Uh, but I really like what he has basically done here. You know, he's been able to charge over $200,000, you know, total earnings on his own independently dude from Chicago. Shout out to uh, my people from Chicago. Right. Um, and this is just this, this website that he did, right? Hampton Adams website, $2,000 right here. Right. And if we look at this website, we do a simple Google search, right? Come in here, paste this in. This is the product page that he basically created for them. Okay. And this is the, the theme that they created. Okay. It's nothing crazy. All right. We're not building, you know, the next Facebook. We're not building something that's extremely difficult. If you know the basics, HTML, CSS, and JavaScript, all of this is very simple for you guys to learn right? I'm not going to tell you guys that's extremely easy, but it's simple for you to learn. Okay. So again, this is what he got paid $2,000 to do. Okay. Now he's already charged over how much I think it's like $200,000, you know, and he's still going to continue to make more money because a lot of people is going to be willing to pay that. Now, going back to the main question, why are companies willing to pay so much money for Shopify developers? I mean, imagine this, they're paying you know, a hundred dollars an hour for an expert to help them out, you know, on a small task or to create a simple theme for them. But then as they continue to grow and their business grows more, they realize that, you know what, it's not worth it for us to continue to pay somebody $200 an hour when we could hire somebody full time and give them benefits and, you know, pay them 90 or pay them 80, you know, and at the same time they get unlimited work. Okay. So, if you guys look in here, this is why there's companies here like this, you know, offering 80, $120,000 with full benefits for somebody. They save a lot of money by hiring somebody full time. Okay. Now, again, not only can you get a job, but you can also be your own boss. We're talking about, you can do freelancing, 
earn top dollar or you know what take the safe route get a job you know and your check is there every single friday but if you are the type of person like myself that is an entrepreneur that thinks about hey if i work on my own i could actually make more money just like this guys that's here okay or you can go and do the freelancing route all right now you could also check out websites like this one themeforest.net where people are actually selling their you know shopify themes which is pretty much is like a template of an online store that people can upload into shopify right you build it on your own and then from there you zip it up make it into a zip file put it online sell it right put in a documentation explaining how to customize their website and pretty much you can start selling a theme like this one i mean this is one of the top selling themes you know 17 000 and 17 and 79 sales that's not bad at all right i mean we could bring out the calculator and do 17 079 sales and let's say times a hundred dollars right that's 1.7 million dollars that's not bad at all i mean again this is another route that you could go for and you could go and create you know your own themes now you also have the other route where you could create applications for shopify and you can literally make millions of dollars it's all on you if you decide hey i just want to learn the bare minimum i want to get a job you can do that but if you want to sell themes there's money in it all right there's even money on creating applications and that's an even bigger pot right you're talking about creating applications for you know hundreds if not thousands of online store like this is another thing that if you guys don't know shopify has its own app store okay where you can go and create apps for e-commerce stores and then from there you know sell your 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 services just like anybody else right let's see right here you got companies like yapo okay this is a product reviews page right this is basically allowing stores to have reviews on their on their basically product pages that's a okay and, and just in here look at the prices that they have you know you can start for free up to 200 orders right um and then from there 20 dollars per month 30 dollars per month now they've had you know 3500 reviews and that's not even counting like the actual number of users that they have okay so we could just say let's say uh, let's give this like a a, a 10 percent of people actually leave reviews and this is actual fact not everybody leaves reviews almost nobody bothers to leave any type of reviews and you know it i mean you watch youtube you watch youtube channels when was the last time that you left a comment you don't leave a comment every single time but you do watch the content it's the same thing as any type of product or service unless you love it or unless you hate it you leave a comment but most people do not care about leaving a comment or leaving a review so if we go in by my standard of like hey if this is 10 percent of the people that have actually used this application and this is on a monthly uh you know recurring income for this company let's say 3520 right times let's say i don't know let's let's put it simple let's say 3500 times eight okay let's say they have twenty eight thousand people or online stores using their services okay now we go in and we say well let's say they're using the the cheapest uh and most affordable thing which is uh 20 bucks 19 dollars per month okay multiply this times 19 that's five hundred thirty five thousand dollars a month on a monthly basis calculate this by 12 six million dollars so the real money is in apps <laughs> okay but i'm showing you guys everything here so just to lay everything down because your career can start here right at the bottom you can say well i got a job as a developer right i got a job as a developer i'm making 80 grand starting right a year later you come in you have so many ideas because you've been in the field you start creating themes from creating themes you go in now you're bringing in an extra five thousand dollars a month by creating themes because you're also in the industry you know exactly what people need and people actually are asking for and you say you know what let me create my own application that application could easily go and make you another ten thousand dollars a month now you're making fifteen twenty thousand dollars a month where now you could say do i want to stay working full-time as a developer 
on a company or do I want to go in and branch out and grow my company? And one thing that I can tell you, I've done this multiple times, right? I've gone in and done things that were a passive income or like side income that I would basically work on on the side when I was working, you know, full time as a developer. And the moment I started going in, you know, head first and doing it full time, that money started doubling, triple and quadruple. That's the truth because you're no longer putting in, you know, two hours in, in a day after you come home from work. Now you're doing it full time and you have this extra income that's, you know, maintaining you. And also, too, I'm pretty sure you guys are going to have savings by that time where you can say, you know what? Let me work full time on my apps. Let me work full time on my themes, whatever it is that you decide to do. Right. And again, it's all on you. Right. Getting into this career of becoming a developer is amazing, but getting into a, a niche field, right? Or a niche industry like e-commerce is even better, less competition, and actually you can make more money because you're actually doing things and learning things on the jobs that you can then later on do it for yourself. Most of these people that you see here that is doing, you know, Upwork and freelancing, they don't start by just, hey, I just should popped up on, on Upwork. No, nah, they go in, they work at companies and did this on the side. Then they realize that, you know what? I could do this full time. There's a demand for it. And I could get paid way better than me working at a company full time. So again, it's all on you on what you want to do. You could always make it, you know, and take that road of keeping it safe and say, I just want to get a job. I like to have my uh, you know, my nights open, I could go out on the weekends and I just work from nine to five. Simple. You could go and get a job just like this, 80 to 120 K you get what I'm saying? So it's very powerful uh, to learn these skills. Now, where can I learn these skills? Very simple guys. You can go to codingphase.com. Okay. At codingphase.com, we teach you all of the skills that you need and all you need to get started is 20 bucks. Okay. I try to make it super affordable for anybody to get started. So like that, there's not like a entry problems or, you know, a barrier to entry or be like, man, I, I can't afford 20 bucks. No, you, you know, you could afford 20 bucks. $20 is $20. This is not going to change your life. <laughs> you know, you're not going to be like, well, I lost $20. No, you go in with $20, you get started. Okay. Now to learn Shopify development, you could go in and either buy the bundle or you could just start from the beginning. Like I said, if you don't know anything, you know, zip, you start with 20 bucks, learn text editors, HTML, CSS, terminal for developers, CSS and Flexbox, SAS like a pro, get like a pro, future proof JavaScript, knowing NPM basics, web developer, personal brand. So you could create your portfolio and you could know how to promote yourself out there so you could get more clients and, and get a job, right? Debugging like a pro object oriented programming, right? We come in and teach you more advanced things for JavaScript because the more things that you know, the more money that you're going to make. That's just a fact. This is the tech industry jQuery, which is, you know, heavily used throughout Shopify. Okay. Um, at the same time, my first Shopify store show you guys how to build an online store. There's people that's charging, you know, uh, $250, $400, $500 just to set up a store for somebody. You learn that here because you're learning how to create a store that even if you wanted to create a store to sell your own products, you get to learn how to do it. You build your first Shopify store, Shopify theme development. We teach you guys how to actually go in and create all of these themes, right? Create themes just like this one. Show you guys how to go in and create, uh, you know, different sections for a online store. Remember what I told you guys, our job is to create the tools, right? And create the looks for the store owners so they can go in and change things on their own. For example, this is a header right here, right? Somebody wanted to come in. This is exactly the same theme that we're building on the course. If somebody wanted to come in and say, Hey, I want to have a menu on the left and I want to have, you know, uh, let's say for uh, like the logo on the left and the menu on the right. Very simple. Okay. We set that up. All the logic is already done there. Okay. We built it with HTML, CSS. We use liquid for the templating engine. We use the schema to create all of this input fields and all of this options here to make it easier for the store owner to just go in and do, you know, whatever changes they might need. One day they might say, you know what? 
uh, we want to go in and have this hero section show up, but with a different title. We created that tool for them to do it. Okay. They could come in, click on hero one. Okay. Change the image. Okay. Click over here, right? This is how easy it is, right? Somebody says, Hey, I want to change the picture on, on, on the front page. We already built that for them. All of these things that I'm showing you guys right now is what we do inside of the course. Okay. We teach you guys how to set up all of this right here, how you are looking at it right now. Okay. Click right here, save the person could easily come in. He don't know anything about code. He could come in, change this and say, Hey, uh, let's say 25% off, uh, for, uh, earth day, right? <laughs> I don't know. Is there an earth day? I don't know. Maybe. Right. But somebody could create a self just for that. Change the font size and say, Hey, I want this to be extra large or large. Okay. Uh, maybe I want to come in and put in a paragraph, put in some more information. Oh, I don't like the paragraph. They could take it out. Hey, they want to add a button. They could add the button, change the thing. Okay. Uh, say claim discount, right? They could do that. And that's it. They didn't have to code anything. We already did the code for them. And then now they could just customize their website. Oh, they don't want this to be full screen. Cool. Let's make this to be, you know, 50% of the screen. Okay. Just like that. So the, the person, when they landed the page, they could see there's a 25% off for earth date and automatically they have access to the products. They click right there. It takes them to the product directly. Okay. All of this is what we do inside of codingphase.com. We teach you all of this so you guys could get comfortable. All right. At the same time, look at this. We go in Shopify theme development. That's what I just talked to you guys about Shopify online store 2.0. This is the latest uh, features that Shopify has released. So we keep you updated on whatever is happening. It's not just, well, you learn how to code, you learn how to do this. And that's it. We just throw you out in the air. No. We come in and we continue to teach you guys the things that's happening within the industry. So you could always be updated and you could always come back and say, you know what? Something new just dropped. Let me continue with uh, my, you know, online courses or online store or online mentor, or whatever you want to call codingphase.com, right? And continue to learn with us. Okay. So even after you get a job, we still want to make sure that you succeed. That's why we talk about Google analytics. This is things that nobody else teaches. Nobody talks about, but when you're doing e-commerce is very important. Google analytics allows you to see where, you know, users coming from, where are, you know, sales coming from, uh, what discounts people are using, what's the most popular page. Those are the things that people need. When you go into this job interviews, they're going to ask you about this and you're going to be able to say, yes, I know about Google analytics because we prepared you at codingphase.com, Facebook and Google ads. They're going to ask you, Hey, can you implement Google tags? Can you implement Facebook pixels? When you go through that process, you're going to be able to, to learn all of these things at coding phase. We're literally preparing you to make sure that you succeed. And it doesn't matter at what level you're at. We want you to succeed. You know, you could say, Hey, I just want my job. Cool. We give you all the tools and skills that you need to get the job. Hey, I want to go in and start selling my own themes to make extra income. Just like the developers that created Wookie. You say, I have a lot of ideas and you know what? I feel I could create the killer app. We also teach you that at codingphase.com Shopify app development. Okay. We teach you all of this. This is for the back end. Once you are very comfortable with the front end, you could always jump into the back end and say, you know what? Now I could go in and have this extra skills. Then not only does this open the doors for you in the Shopify industry, right? Or the Shopify uh, e-commerce niche, but you can also use the same skills that you're using for Shopify to go work for any tech company that you like. You don't have to just stay, Hey, I'm only staying with Shopify. Once you learn all of the skills, this is the same skills that you're going to need to work at any tech company too. Okay. But again, we're trying to teach you something that you're going to get results right away and you're going to get into the game as soon as possible. Now, again, you want to go and become your own boss, build your own company. This is what we teach on the entrepreneur developer career bundle. Okay. Learn how to build your own business, learn how to set up your LLC, set up your S corp, how to save money on, on taxes. What's actually an expense. What's not an expense, right? Uh, what you consider income. There's so many things, right? How to find a good accounting. Like we go in and we teach you all of this at codingphase.com. Now, of course, 
everything that you see that has a fire emoji that's part of the premium courses where we go in and you know this is for people that sign up for a whole year of codingphase.com so if you sign up for a whole year right and you want to get access to everything yeah it's going to be 397 dollars. but again this is way worth the money like you're getting so much we're literally teaching you everything that you need to get a job but then at the same time teaching you to become your own boss okay guys there's people that come in and pay thousands and thousands of dollars at boot camps go to college and they don't even get a quarter of the information that you're going to get here at codingphase.com but again i don't want you guys to get scared and be like whoa it's 397 dollars nah bro you could get started with 20 bucks Everything that you need to become a front end developer is there. Okay. Everything that you need to become a front end developer, everything is right here. All of this is part of just the $20 per month. Okay. You want to become a back end developer, everything is right there. Full stack developer, everything is right there. All of that is part of just 20 bucks. Right. So again, the barrier to entry is very low. Okay. We want you to come in, learn how to code. We want to make sure that you succeed. But again, we want to go and hold your hand and, and teach you guys all of these things. So it's not just like, well, we taught you what programming is. What do you do with programming? <laughs> right? Uh, well, I know how to code. Okay, but what can you build with that? This is why Coding Face is different than everybody else because we actually go in and teach you guys everything that you need to get a job by simulating the things that you're going to do at the job and also to freelancing and also to by you building your own apps and, and creating your own businesses so again guys that's where you learn how to do shopify development again like i said you could get started learn all of this for 20 bucks once you want to get into the shopify development sign up for the yearly subscription okay it's the best thing that you're going to do it basically gives you access to the whole website it's not just the shopify courses but every single career bundle react developer shopify theme developer shopify app developer entrepreneur developer and every single course that comes out within codingphase.com it's like you sign up for a whole year and you get unlimited access to everything it's the best thing that you can do but again so let's get started guys and i'll see you guys on the website okay click on the links below get started today okay you might see some discounts on the description of this video or on this video if you click on it so yeah, I'll see you guys around. Take care.